Hello folks, this is Danny Lawrence. Welcome back to my channel. Last month I ran out of my house heating oil, so I decided to make this video for new homeowners or who has similar kind of heating system. So whenever you ran out of your heating oil, the first thing you need to do after filling up your oil tank, that is, you need to bleed the oil and remove the air to restart your heating system. In case of any emergency, if you cannot fill up your tank right away, you can buy diesel from any nearest gas station and put it into your oil tank and then restart your heating system by bleeding the oil. The purpose of this video is to save the money because it really easy to do. It cost me 25 bucks it cost me 25 bucks as I hired a professional to bleed, which you can easily do by yourself. Hence, I made this video just for you so that you can save that money. Here we go. You crack it open. Save it so you don't bleed it. So you want to keep the water bottle there, you mm -hmm. hit the reset. Gonna shoot out air and oil. You get a nice steady stream of, of oil. You tighten it. Sometimes it takes a few times because this locks itself out. It's like a safety thing. Then you gotta wait for this to reset. See how it's shooting out. You can hear the air. Yeah. Oh, you gotta hit it. It's in a short one. This is the See, this is the 5%, that sucks. Normally this will run for a while, let you uh -huh. try to bleed it. This yeah. one shuts off quick, so then you gotta wait for it to reset. I, th I think you need to hold for uh, like about 30 seconds, this thing. The, the electronic yeah. ones, yes. This one, you just gotta wait. The, like the ones that are just like this. The, yeah. Like there's ones that are electronic that you, you have to like hold for a short amount of seconds, like go, hit it yeah. again. It's the, every single one's different too. That's why it turns into a, like a... Yeah, one more time, she got ready. It took 227, so normally a tank holds about 250. To avoid any kind of spill or any mess, you can use a container. Uh, I didn't use any container because uh, there is a sponge on the ground. That's a 275 holds 250. It's a raw. 250, yeah. Yeah. But it should take 250. It only took 227. But those kind of those gauges could be off, but the, those tanks, sometimes those whistles go off prematurely. Hey, that's a good sign. That's good. Well, you hear it, sometimes yeah. it'll conk out. It'll, uh, it'll a little bit. 